we have a student employee diligently doing their duty to the university. They may have started this job without experience, but look at them now. They're a fully-fledged library assistant at the B.D. Owens Library. But they're not the only ones working hard for that Bearcat pride. Now, Bobby Bearcat wants you to apply for a job at the library. Let's start out by dispelling some misconceptions about working at the library. Hello, student. Do you enjoy reading? No? Well, that's misconception number one. Contrary to popular belief, you don't need to like reading in order to work at the library. In fact, reading books isn't even in the job description, so don't worry if you're not a bookworm. As a student employee at the B.D. Owens Library, your responsibilities lean heavily towards customer service. That's right, our student employees are the face of the B.D. Owens Library, so be sure to smile and list any experience you have in your application. But working the front desk isn't the only job you'll be doing. Throughout the day, there are sure to be a couple of challenges, but when they arise, be sure to remain calm. Remember, they came to you for help, so don't be afraid to lend a helping hand. Another important skill to know in your application is detail-oriented. As a library assistant, part of your responsibilities is shelving returned materials. <laughs> Don't worry, our trained library staff will teach you what goes where. But while you're at the shelves, best make sure that the shelves are clean and well maintained. Finally, other responsibilities include taking inventory of the collection and overseeing activity within the building. Let's start with the former. Taking inventory is an essential and vital task for library assistants. But fear not, it's not as difficult as it may sound. In short, taking inventory is simply making sure that all library materials are where they are supposed to be. This copy of The Art of War doesn't belong in the children's section. Let's put it back where it belongs. Moving right along, oversight of activity in the building is very important. As the face of the library, students and guests will come to you with any questions they may have. Where can I find so-and-so's office? Are there any open study rooms? Where can I find a quiet place to study? As a library assistant, it is your responsibility to provide directions and aid to all of these questions and more. Now the time has come for you to fill out your application, but what to include? Well, experience is important. Be sure to list any job you've had where you worked in customer service. But don't stop there. Who said experience had to be paid? Include volunteer work, extracurricular leadership, or even group projects. We're looking to see how well you engage with people, so be thorough when you sell yourself. What are your strengths? List them all and link them to job requirements. For example, you could say, as a charismatic person, I get along with people easily and identify with their needs. It is also required to include a cover letter with your application. This tells the employer who you are and what skills you bring to the job. This is your chance to really sell yourself as a person. Remember, including a cover letter can only benefit your application. Lastly, refer to career services and have them look over your application before you submit it. They can help out in ways that we can't, plus it's their job and they'll happily look over your application for free. This concludes our pitch. We hope this experience has been beneficial and that we'll see your application real soon. Remember, the B.D. Owens Library wants you to join the library staff today.